Hey guys, so popular Nigerian gospel singer Frank Edwards has made a post on social media that has the whole of the internet talking. You guys, this seems to be like he's advising Moses Bliss and also the blessed, you know, about, you know, this whole social media thing. He put up a post on Facebook and this is what the post said. He said, feed them with your music or your products, but keep your family away from online people. Demons are here too. That is witches and wizards. <laughs> they are on this social media space to protect your family. And you guys, this um, post on Facebook has sparked a lot of reaction on social media. But let me know your thoughts are, guys, in the comment section first. What do you think about the post he made? You know, basically, if you're a celebrity, gospel artist, if you sell products and you have become popular, he just really is advising that hide your family away from social media because the demons you are scared of from in your village, they are on this social media too, you know. So let me know what you think in the comment section. But for me, I'm actually... um. I will not say conflicted. I think it's about balance. I think it's about balance when it comes to social media. I can't even imagine, um, you know, somebody living a life. For instance, there are people who are extroverted, people who are introverted. So an extroverted person, obviously, would want to share, you know, maybe they have a... Um, they bought a new car. They might want to just show a plate number, not even really show the car or just want to... Say, do a little celebration or they even got a degree they just want to show their convocation show their wig and you know sorry their cap and um, graduation cap and everything on social media it, it i don't know why i feel like imagine living a life where you want to just be expressive and you cannot be expressive because you are scared of demons you know on the other hand as um a public um person or as a social media person somebody who is influential who has a large following i understand that demon or those demons he's trying to talk about or saying protect yourself from because listen in the past week i have seen a lot of comments on social media and listen these demons are not even where they're not rubbing white chalk on their eyes anymore you know how you see them in nollywood african magic and they have this white chalk under their eyes and they have these red skirts and everything no no no, no. these demons are educated they have degrees phd everything they have phones android phones iphones computers laptops everything they have it they are on social media replying comments under the comment section because what in the witchcraft is the kind of comments i see sometimes okay look at what happened with the messaging one baby thing the past week you know people even apart from the bloggers who actually came out to say oh this baby looks like this and that you know they were people who actually were agreeing with those bloggers so even when the bloggers were saying i'm sorry they're like ah stop saying you are sorry oh, this baby looks like this person no this people should go and do this so so i get what he's saying i feel like there should be a healthy balance for instance mrs bliss wedding he wanted to do a wedding he invited his colleagues and most of his colleagues are popular people so you can see that they came there with their cameras ready to showcase um content so you see that even without him planning for his wedding to go viral he did you cannot fault him for that. He cannot say, oh, people can do it. Say, when you come for my wedding, don't make any videos. You can do that if you want to. But I don't think somebody should do a wedding and say, don't post my videos online because they are scared of demons. I don't think I want to live that kind of life. I, for one, doesn't want to live that kind of life. I don't want to live that kind of life. But I also believe very well in healthy balance. A very healthy balance. Your family... If you know you're on social media and you know that these demons are working, you know, without slippers up and down, <laughs> you can hide as much as you can hide. Maybe you show your babies once in a while, um, you show your family once in a while, just some special location, maybe birthday celebrations, um, milestones you can show. But if you know that these people are, because these trolls are not resting. Imagine trolling babies. We see that online every day. And that's why most times people hide their baby's faces till the first birthday. Then you see people now show the babies on their first birthdays and babies still get showed. So I don't think you have so much control over this demon too. <laughs> I would say that. I just really think that everybody should know what is um, a healthy balance for them. If a healthy balance for you is that we will never get to see your children online or never get to see any of your achievements online till, you know, forever, no problem. As long as it works for you. But I don't want to fault those people who want to just show a little, you know, or want to show excessively. Listen, this life, for all we know, in our own life, I'm telling you, you know, I don't want to fault those people who want to show excessively. It might be even a way for them to cope from things they are going through or just something to make them happy that they are sharing their lives. 
people make so much money from reality shows from reality tv so you see that people want to watch people's lives yes the downside is that people will not have so much opinion about your life that they don't really know so much about i get that which is probably why frank edward is screaming protect your family so that people who don't know you will not now have opinions about you and not come and make videos about you totally totally like i said um, in the ay video yesterday with his wife when they came out to say their marriage was crashing i said we really don't want to know so much because really social people on social media they don't really care they're just looking for gist and that's it when you're a celebrity when you're a public figure your life is just really content a lot of times for a lot of people so that is why you should protect the family but i don't think that you should what's the word you should not live your life because you are scared of demons i just really hope somebody understood this video i feel it sounds like a lecturer <laughs> i just hope somebody understood this whole video and make it like for you know for me it's just about a healthy balance a very healthy balance whatever is balanced for you balance for you might not be balanced for frank edwards balance for mrs bliss may not also be balanced for mrs chino and balance for mrs chino may be different from what it is um for nathaniel bassi because look at nathaniel bassi he didn't do anything Guy was just on his own, minding his business, and they came and dragged him and Mr. Chimwa and joined body. You understand? So, you see, balance is different. And sometimes you even finish balancing. Somebody from outside will still come and put your name inside, everything no concern you. Like in the case of Nathaniel Bassi, you see. And okay, like for Mr. Chimwa too, what happened? They just um, dedicated their babies. And most people dedicate their babies and show it online. Do you understand? It was a concert. A baby was dedicated. Picture was shared online. Then the next thing, boom, the monster they are talking. So I feel like it's just about balance. But I also feel like when you become a celebrity, this is just like one of the downsides. You may never completely be able to uh, run away or move yourself from public opinion. Sadly, sadly, it's one of the downsides. But I think with Frank Edward's advice, if you try to have that healthy balance, you can reduce the way you're talked about negatively to the barest minimum let me know your thoughts are guys in the comment section what do you think for you for you is it about balance or if i'm a celebrity i will not post my, you will never see my children you never see my husband i'll never post online you know what's your thoughts um what's your opinion what do you think what what do you think would work for you if you were a celebrity and what do you think these celebrities should do to review um, to reduce the cases of these demons and these witches and wizards you know walking around on social media without sleepers share in the comment section guys it's a real show thank you for watching i'll see you in my next one bye